guys, we're back in the kitchen. Um, we are about to make cauliflower tortillas. So I guess we're going to get started. So the ingredients we are going to be using are cauliflower florets, um, eggs, pink salt, and pepper. Okay, so we are going to firstly preheat our oven to 375. And then we're going to line a baking tray with parchment paper. Oh, I opened a new one. That's going to take a minute. Oh. I mean, I always do that. I make it way too big. That's all right. right now is we're going to pulse the cauliflower in this food processor and we want it finer than cauliflower rice and we want two packed cups so I may need to use this extra cauliflower here but let's see we're going to put some of this in there we'll do a little bit at a time can see this consistency but I'm going to reach over so you kind of can. Alright, so I'm going to start with that. So we've got one cup packed and we need one more cup. So I'm going to get the rest of this out and put a little bit more of that cauliflower in to be riced. So we've got our riced cauliflower, two cups packed. We're going to microwave for this for two minutes and then we are going to stir and then microwave for another two minutes. Ooh. So after mixing at the two minute mark and cooking for another two minutes, we now have very hot cauliflower and we're going to put it in this tea towel um, and wring it out. Get all the excess water out of that. Oh. It's a lot harder to do with one hand. Okay. You're kind of going to roll it up like this and just twist, but after you've let it cool down for a little while, it's a lot easier. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to let it cool for a little bit and then we are going to twist all that water out. So we've got our cauliflower in here and we really want to wring all that water out which I've already wrung some out right before this but you can kind of see it just coming out. And you want to keep going until you get it all out. And I even go back the other way just and then I open it up and move it a bit around a bit using that spoon just kind of Do that again. So you've got all that water out of there. And I mean, you use some good strength on this, guys, because if you leave all that water in there, you're not going to get the consistency that you need in your tortillas. So we need to get it all out till it won't come out anymore. Oh, and now I've broken a hole in my bag and we're getting some of that out. All right. I think we've got it all out for the most part. And you're going to have quite a bit of water. Well, you guys can't really see that because I'm using a tripod, but there's quite a bit of water in here, as you can kind of see. Okay, so I've put our drained cauliflower in a bowl and we're going to add our one egg. And then our three egg whites. A little bit of yolk in there, but it's all right. Make sure we get all that out. And then we're going to mix, and it's going to be liquidy, but not pure liquid. And we're also going to add our salt and pepper. I'm going to add some salt and pepper, and that's to taste. Oh my goodness, and I, look what just happened. It's all right. I'll spoon some of it out. We'll be okay. Wow. That just happened. All right, that'll be all right. Don't let that happen. Be, let it be a lesson to you. And we're going to put some pink salt. 
pink salt and then mix it all in again. Okay, as you can see, we're gonna spoon this mixture into six even circles like tortillas. You just press that down with that. See all the pepper I accidentally spilled in there, you guys? Okay, so we're putting those tortillas in the oven for 10 minutes and then we are going to flip them. 10 minutes is up. And now I just have to very carefully flip these. Where did that thing go? Okay. Uh oh. There we go. I'm going to put them back in for another five. Uh, to seven minutes. Back in the oven after you flip them for another five to seven minutes. All right, now we're gonna let these puppies cool in a wire rack. Gosh, they look good. Man, they smell good too. All right, we're gonna let them cool down. So when you're ready to use your tortillas, you just wanna heat up a skillet and you want to just brown them in your skillet, so we're just going to grab two of those. I can do two at once. Just brown them, and then you can put whatever you want in between them. Use them for whatever you want. Um, I'm actually using the beef sausage I made earlier mixed with some onions and bell peppers as the filling in, I guess, a tortilla sandwich <laughs> for my lunch today. best part of these cauliflower tortillas is they're only 33 calories each.